Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to talk about running belts or water belts that are used for running or walking or whatever. Um, and basically, um, we're getting into running season. And so um, this was my initial running belt that I used all the time. I've used this for literally thousands of miles um, of running. And it's worked great for years and years. Um, the only issue is that there's only one water bottle. The water bottle got nasty, that's why I'm not showing it because you know I used it so much that it yellowed and, and didn't, uh, didn't hold up as well. Um, but uh, the reason I wanted to get a new one is because it's hot in Charlotte, I wanted to have a lot, of, a lot more water with me or at least double the amount of water with me. So I ended up going out and buying a new water belt. So this is a Nathan water belt and uh, I wanted to stick with Nathan's water belts because of a couple reasons. One is I've tried other ones and they jump around on me. So they, they move up and down on your waist when you're running and you feel it kind of like, it's like, it's like strapping a, a bag to you, you just feel it kind of bobbling a lot around. The Nathan running belts, the, the reason I love them so much is because the they stay in place. They literally sit on your hips and so when you're running, and if you had a water bottle in this and you're running, it does not jump around. It doesn't move around. Even when I'm running, it won't move around at all and they're comfortable. So they have an elastic band up. So once you put them in place, they have a little bit of give to them, but not a ton. So you're not getting a lot of bouncing when you're using the water bottles or using the running belts. So this is my original one, still my favorite. Um, the only issue, like I said, it only has one water bottle. That's why I wanted to get another one. The only other issue I had with it is the zipper broke. So it has a little pocket here and uh, the zipper on the pocket broke, and so that no longer works, which isn't a huge deal for me, but if it is for you, it doesn't fit a cell phone either. It's a very small pocket, so typically I threw my car keys in there um, if I was running on a, on a trail or something like that, but it will, not fit, it will not fit a cell phone in there because now cell phones are much bigger. Okay, so because I like Nathan as much as I do and it works so well for me, I went with a new upgraded model. So um, just got this one. This is a new upgraded model, um, and I don't like it as much. Um, in fact, there's some things I really don't like about it at all. Um, so I'm still using this one and putting my new water bottles in it because it just frankly works better. Um, the cage of the water bottle is a full plastic cage, so you can see it's, it's plastic, and it holds the water bottle really secure in place. There's not a lot of elastic to it. This, this is just basically a, um, like a, a, a nylon, right, that holds it in place. It has enough give to it that the water bottle slides in here. I'll show you quick. The water bottle slides into it and it stays secure in that, that cage. It does not fall out, doesn't have any issues with it. The new improved um, water belt, it's all based on having this where it's basically elastic, so it stretches and moves. So I found two problems with this. One is this water bottle, for whatever reason, pops out all the time. So if it has water in it, I'm running, and I am not an aggressive runner. I'm running probably eight to eight minute miles to eight 30 minute miles, at best seven 30 minute miles. Um, so I'm not, I'm not going that fast. These are very loose, so as soon as you put this on, um, this water bottle has a tendency to pop out. Not even if I hit it, it has a tendency to pop out. The other side doesn't pop out, but what it is doing is fraying. So you can see that it's fraying already at the, where the plastic meets. So again, I, I'm not using this a ton. I probably have put this, I probably maybe put 300 miles on using this. So I've had this one um, since about mid-January. So, um, and I've had it so about two months, <clears throat> and I've probably put on about 300 miles total, um, and maybe two to say three months. So, and you can see that's not gonna last. It's not gonna last at all. And that's the one that works. The other side, the water bottle pops out. So that's the, the main issue I have with it. The belt itself, um, they made it much more elastic, and I think that's part of the problem is that sure, it's much more elastic, but because of that, when you put the belt on, it stretches out. If you look from the top, when you put it on, it stretches out the, the basket that holds the water bottle. And because of that, 
you know, I like it to be secure so I don't feel the, the water bottles bouncing around. Because of that, I think it makes it easier for the water bottles to pop out. So I will say the one thing I do like about it um, is it still has the same clasps, which is pretty, pretty standard. I like that it's easy to cinch around my waist on both sides. It has a cinch thing. So it, it stays, it has the same thing as the old version that you can't buy anymore. It has the same version of that, um, which is really kind of nice. Um, the new pockets are really nice in it. You know, it's got one that's more of, an, uh, of a nylon that you can see through that, you know, obviously would be good with getting wet and, and drying. And then it has more of a bigger pocket that you can put keys in, you can put your cell phone in, you can put other things in there as well. Um, you know, if you do those gel packs or whatever when you run, it holds all that really well. So I like that. The water bottles themselves do not leak. They're very, very good. I like the, the water bottles themselves. The new upgraded belt though just isn't gonna work. Okay, so, you know, frankly, I keep going back to my old one. The old one works better. The old one was also $30, which was nice. The new one is about $50 to $60, and uh, frankly, it's a deal breaker. The water bottles pop out, which is a big pain in the butt because I end up having to turn around and go get them. And, uh, and it's not gonna last. You can see the fraying and it's not gonna last. Love the new pocket, love that I can put my cell phone in and additional things in that, but they have to fix the baskets of the water bottles or it just won't work for most runners. So, Nathan, go back to the old baskets. They worked. Don't change what doesn't need to be fixed. Um, so do that, add this new, add the old basket to the new belt, um, and I'm back in. I'll, I'll be a buyer again. Otherwise, uh, I have to move on and try to find something that works better. So that's it. Subscribe to my channel. I'll put a link in the description below to the new Nathan Water Belt. You guys can check out on your own. Um, and then uh, I'll try to find something that's similar to the old and put a link in the description below as well. That's it. Subscribe to my channel. Let us know what worked for you for running um, or, or whatever your outdoor activity is, hiking or whatever. Um, this, is, this is what works for me, the old one. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks.